As we know, there are many versions of veganism, and not all of them go hand in hand. It stands to reason that if some version is the correct one, then all those versions which are in conflict with it cannot also be correct. For example, it is rare, but there are pro-life vegans who believe that abortion on demand is immoral and how it shouldn't be done. They should argue against vegans who think that insentient unborn children have no moral value and killing them is like killing a germ or a plant. Some vegans ignore this issue and try to sweep it under the rug. In a discussion with a vegan, let's call him Jack, when I mentioned that some other vegans say the opposite of what he says, Jack told me, I don't care what they say. When I ask him, why doesn't he debate them? and show them that they are wrong, I got no response. Vegans should be at each other's throats. If there's something like actual correct veganism, vegans need to weed it out and renounce incorrect ones. For some, veganism leads to the reduction of harm of wildlife. Others would say nonsense. It's just about not exploiting animals. And then we have reduced terrians. But if I accept, quote unquote, veganism of this so-called vegan, and this one says to me, So a little bit of cruelty is okay, UV? You're not a fucking vegan. You're a fucking snaggle tooth fucking bitch is what you are. I don't want to be name called by other so-called vegans just because I adopted one version of veganism. I see no reason why I should jump blindly into all of that mess. If you think that your veganism is the correct one, and veganism of others is incorrect, and you want people to be vegan, actually vegan, then your priority should be to argue against incorrect veganism. Because if you don't cure that cancer, it'll just grow and spread.